second so. part is structure. Mm. If you are bringing a child home from public school for the first time, or you're making a transition change from a co-op, or you, a lot of families I work with have had their children in psychiatric facilities and bringing them home, like right. deep trauma. Yep. Mm-hmm. Structure is so important. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Our brains are wired to need a <laughs> rhythm of the day. Your brain yeah. yep. is constantly going to work in ways that it needs to fix problems. When you mm-hmm. wake up around the same time, And then we have this routine and we eat around the same time and Mm -hmm. we go for walks around the same time. The more rhythm in the day we can put that's consistent, our brain isn't thinking, is this a flight or flight moment? Why are we doing this differently? Why is this? It's not happening to set off when it's already Mm -hmm. on fire, right? It's already looking for trauma responses everywhere. Mm -hmm. When some days we wake up at eight and some days we wake up at noon and some days we start with this. Yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Because you have to go through that process every yes. time. So yes, that is such and your a good brain is having to deal with suggestion. that. Mm-hmm. Create rhythm, create a rhythm with the day. Mm-hmm. And so we kind of wake up at the same time. What we do in the same time. This is, you know, I am still even during our years of helping my son heal. We still learned a lot. And we'll talk about that in a minute. Yeah. Learning doesn't have to stop just because it's not in the books, right? Mm-hmm. We helped mm-hmm. rebuild so much. But the more consistency, like on Tuesdays or library days, and on Thursdays we go for hikes or mm-hmm. whatever that routine is, right. create one. Mm-hmm. And it does not matter to me. I mean, I am somebody, every family has their own thing. If they're up at 12, because y'all are up till midnight, because you're a late night family, because they do school from eight till midnight. Okay. Right. Yep. Just yeah. have a <laughs> Some kind of schedule. Yeah, I yes. actually put Brandon in classes in Australia at one point because he was way better. That is a great than suggestion. <laughs> he is a night owl. He's really wired uh-huh. to be a third work, work um, shift person, right? right. Like yeah. God wired him that way. And they, we cannot break that in our culture, Peggy, because if mm. we do, who will be our third night work nurses and firemen and people to protect us? So at night true. We rest? Yes. Uh-huh. We cannot break that and expect nine to five. So I honored how God wired him and just put him in classes in Australia. That is <laughs> like, very <yeah>. creative. <laughs> you do what you got to do. You That's do. what you do. Yeah, and exactly. he thought it was cool because he could do you taking classes at 11 at night. And he's mm-hmm. like, woo, he, his brain's on fire wow. at 11 o'clock at night. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So anyway. So create your structure.